Greetings all, Ferrari Man 601 here. What are we doing looking at a sink? Well, quick demonstration of some principles of aerodynamics and downforce generation and such. Yeah, here's a flat surface, butter knife. Flat surface presented to a parallel flow. Trying to come into this as close to 90 degrees as possible without my fingers interrupting the flow. Uh, yeah, you can see as the uh, flat side of the knife makes contact with it, you can see that uh, we're displacing the flow, but the knife just basically sits flat and level, just holding it very loosely, uh, allowing it to rotate a little bit as it makes contact with the water there with the uh, trailing edge. Yeah, it's just sort of pushing it aside and the knife is being pushed away from the flow. However, we put a spoon in this same flow. First of all, let's put the uh, scoop side into the flow. What happens? It gets pushed away. It just bounces off of it, as you can see there. However, if we put the back side of the spoon there, and you can see it has this very nice curving shape, sort of like the under tray of a race car. Well, we bring it in. The flat side of the spoon makes contact. Ha! Ah, look at that. Again, I'm just holding the spoon very loosely. As it makes contact with the flow, it actually gets sucked into it. And you can also see, if we move the spoon up, you can see the deflection of the flow as it leaves that trailing edge of the spoon. Does that sort of look like the rooster tail that comes off the back of a formula car? Yeah, it kind of does. What you're seeing is downforce, basically. Yeah. And you're also seeing the Klonda effect coming in here a little bit. That's the tendency of flows to attach themselves to adjacent surfaces. Have a look, and you can even see a little bit of turbulence there. The spoon, any the oscillation you can see there from left to right, that is not my hand tremor. That is the actual flow dynamic happening as turbulences get set in with that flow underneath the spoon or to the left as well as to the right over top there, spilling over the handle. So, yeah, as it gets pulled in, that is physics. I am not pushing the spoon into the flow. I am just moving it closer so that contact is made. And as it gets sucked into it, that is pure physics. Downforce generation and some hydrodynamic turbulence as well. Very cool. Very, very cool effect. That has been an aerodynamics lecture from FMAM. Thanks for watching.